Hey guys, so I'm gonna be vlogging a, what would you call it, a hypnotist show. Yep. He's called Sebastian Steele. And yeah, so I'm gonna sneak my phone in there and record a little bit. And then I'm hopefully gonna be up on stage because I honestly have no idea if this hypnotist thing is true or not. So I'm kinda like open to the idea, but it's kinda like disbelief at this point. I'm gonna explain everything afterwards, how everything went and blah, blah, blah. Okay, so bye. Anybody here tonight that has been hypnotized before? Let me see. Hands up. One, person. one, two, three. Three of you. Keep them up, Miss High. I want to talk to you. How many times? Twice. Once. Twice. Okay. And did you have fun? Uh, no. No. <laughs> Was it me? Okay. Shoot. Did you? Apparently, you were pretty entertaining. Okay. When you're hypnotized, you're going to feel no different than you feel right now. You'll actually be conscious and aware the entire time. If you actually go to sleep, you went too far. Okay? All hypnosis is, is just relaxation. That's it. Child going to sleep at night, the closer they get to going to sleep, the more they relax, they see clothing over a chair, imagination starts making shapes out of the clothes, they get close to sleep, imagination goes out, looks like the boogeyman, they know it's clothing, but when they get closer, f that, I'm hiding. It's basically hypnosis. We tell you on the count of three, you can speak Chinese, your imagination in a relaxed state says, okay, you start talking gibberish, but your heads are going, f I'm speaking it. <laughs> and I'm doing good. So that's basically what hypnosis is. That's simple. So sitting up in your chairs, all hips so I have no power over you, okay? No lightning bolts on my fingertips, none of that stuff. You do the hypnotizing yourself. On the count of three, I'm going to get you to take a deep breath in, fill your lungs, let that breath go. On the count of three, deep breath in. One, two, three. And three. Your subconscious mind is the mind that controls you. It controls your emotions. It controls your reactions to any one of your feelings, your senses. It controls how creative your imagination is. For the duration of this show, everything your subconscious mind hears my voice speak, your subconscious mind simply has you imagining it to be real. Everything my voice says happens. Anytime you hear my voice give the command to wide awake, you sit up with your eyes wide open. Anytime you hear my voice give the command to sleep, your subconscious mind will instantly shut you down and return you to this state of relaxation that you are in right now. On the count of three, everybody's going to become wide awake. Here we go. One, two, three, wide awake. All right, now, I'll get you off the floor, dear, and back into your chair. Just read into your chair there. You can grab a seat. Thanks for trying, man. Okay. You too. And you guys, thanks for trying. Nice to you. And grab a seat. Thank you so much for coming up and trying. And I hope you have an awesome birthday. We may not have gotten up on stage, but don't worry. We'll send some people out there to f with you. <laughs> <laughs> you like that? Awesome. All right. Okay. So. Now we're going to see out of this bunch who we're keeping up on stage. So here's what I need you all to do. I need you all to just simply take both your arms and just hold them straight out in front of you. Now, you no actually, point. you better grab some in the audience too. She landed on you and you were giggling away. So, but thank you for trying here. Awesome. So I'll get you just to slide over to this empty chair right here, and then again, everybody's arms straight up in front of you. Now. Clasp your hands together, interlocking your fingers. Hypnosis is a focus. I'm not going to show you. But I do want to show you how good of a shot I am. Okay. Ready, I'm going to show you how good of a shot I am. Are you ready? See that exit sign over there? See the X? Where the X meets in the middle? 
I'm going to bullseye that. Are you ready? Check this out. to swim around the little round thing. One, two, three. And on the count of three, the teeny thing with the tail, well, it penetrates the little round thing. One, two, three. Ooh. Now the little round thing starts to grow, splitting into two little round things. And the two little round things splitting into four little round things. And so on, and so on, getting bigger, and bigger until you realize <gasps> you are nine months pregnant! <laughs> How the hell did that happen? <laughs> Gentlemen, your uterus started off the size of a pear. And it's now expanded to the size of a beach ball. And you feel that through stabbing pains in your rib cage. <laughs> You're getting hot flashes now. Lower back pains. <laughs> your ankles are sore and swollen, and you feel very bloated as you're heavily retaining water. <laughs> your breasts are bigger. <laughs> but they are extremely sore and tender. You just lactated. <laughs> the baby kicks. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> On the count of three, it kicks again. And oh my God, you just gotta have someone feel it. One, two, three. Ooh. Daddy's on the count of three. 
baby you're gonna push, when you push, the head of that baby's gonna come out. Now, I'm gonna be honest with you. This really hurts. You see, the head of that baby is the size of a grapefruit. Stretches things down there. Sometimes, it's even been known to tear. <laughs> so word of advice, the screaming really helps. So here we go. One contraction, two contraction, three push, go! So they need you just to grip their hands so that you got some strength. Not hard, just some grip. Now they also need to know that they can trust you, so make eye contact with your doctor. Look at your doctor. Look at your doctor. Good, because that's not your doctor. That's your baby! Oh! Sit your baby on your lap! Oh! Rock your baby! Oh yeah, rock your baby! Cradle your baby! Yeah! Sing to your baby! Sing some funny faces at your baby. <laughs> yes, and baby loves bouncy horsey ride on your knee. Yes, he does. Bouncy horse. Get on your knee. Get your baby on there. Oh, you're going to drop him. Now, daddies, listen up. Listen up. I read this book, and according to this book, what babies love more than anything in the whole wide world. <laughs> What babies love more than anything in the whole wide world, according to this book, if you do this, you are super dad. Now, you might want to get a really good strong grip on your baby because you'd be surprised how quick they learn to walk. <laughs> <laughs> Just get them right on up there and cradle them. Yeah, get them right on up there. What babies love more than anything oh, is when you give them that oh, the tummy. Oh, they love Get your face right in there! Give another one! And wide away! Thanks for coming up, you guys. Right on. Thank you so much. You rock for St. John. God bless you. Take care. 
All right, so um, I just got out of the uh, hypnotist uh, show. It was very interesting. I enjoyed myself, but apparently I didn't get hypnotized, so yeah. There you go, now you see me. <laughs> so I did try, guys. All the snow, look at the snow, guys. Oh, sorry, guys. Okay, um, apparently it was like way too dark for me to uh, say goodbye, so I'm here in my van. Well, Eric's van, technically, yes. Uh, he, uh, he bought it, uh, what, three, four days ago? Yeah, so, yay, he got his own vehicle again, so that's really exciting. But anyway, um, so the show, he did like an, uh, an outro thing, basically inspiring people to, you know, be kind to uh, animals, with mo specifically pets, be kind to, to children and stuff like that. And so those, those points were like a win in my book. So I had a lot of fun going to his uh, show. I don't know if I would recommend it to anybody because like I said, I didn't get hypnotized, so I have no idea, but a lot of people enjoyed their time there and like lots of people laughed like there's like this girl that was right behind us like laughing constantly so I'm sure she'll like 10 out of 10 like say go sh watch his show so but I thought he was funny he made me laugh quite a few times and Eric said he enjoyed it quite quite a bit so yeah so that was my evening so yeah hopefully you guys uh, enjoyed the few clips that I shared with you and I will see you possibly next week uh maybe possibly for like with a diy or maybe another vlog who knows all right bye guys